This is the type of jar that Miracle or Miracle Whip used to come in years ago. If this has cabbage soup in it, it still looks beautiful even though it's old. And it used to be they had the word ball printed right on the bottom of the jar. It's a wide mouth jar. The ball lid fits on it perfectly. And it's a it's a great wide mouth jar. It's not officially recommended that you can can in these, but I have hundreds of them. And I have friends who have canned for years and years with them. And I have had just as much success rate with the jars holding up as with the jars you pay $8 a dozen for. I paid 50 cents a dozen for these at garage sales. If you can still find them, I would grab them up. Even if I had to pay $1.50 a dozen for them, I would grab them up. But they're a very reliable jar if you use the precautions that are listed in the video about um, why canning jars break. You shouldn't have any trouble with these at all. I pressure canned with them for years. We had did hundreds of quarts of green beans in them. There were old Orville Redenbacher popcorn used to come in a glass jar. And um, a few other things came in glass jars. Uh, a company made spaghetti sauce that had an Atlas canning jar, and there was a couple of others that were, I think they were a little less than a quart. But these were dynamite, and I'm so glad that I still have them, and I would, in a heartbeat, use them again. I just, you need to be sure you avoid temperature extremes, just like you do with a regular canning jar. Don't put a cool jar into a hot, a hot boiling pot of water. Uh, don't put a hot jar into a cool draft. Let the temperature raise a little gently with them. Um, they're just, oops. <laughs> They just have really been awesome jars, and I have friends that are just as fond of them as I am. So they're not officially recommended, but they were originally made by the ball company. Some of them still have ball written on the bottom. This one I don't think does, um, but they're awesome jars. So that's what I have to say today. I'm sure I'll add something to it later. God bless. Bye.